John from Eastley Boxing Repeat here with Victorious Bradley Ree. Bradley, mate, what a performance that was. Yeah, yeah mate, happy. Happy, yeah. a good win. You know what, you should be because nobody stops Alice or Warren like that. Yeah, um, but I mean, mate, I had, I had in my head coming into the fight and knew it was, it, it was a step up. A big step up from the level I've been competing at. Um, I've been telling everyone that that step up bring the best out of me, you know what I mean? Um, I think evidently it has done. It certainly has, because you know what I was just saying before we started doing this, Alistair Warren last year beat Marcus Morrison. Yeah. Marcus Morrison has just been to Italy recently yeah. uh, and, and won that version you know, of a, a, a sort of rankings belt yeah, that he's yeah. won and now you just stopped the same guy he got beat off last year. That's kind of, to me, that makes a statement for you yeah, at this stage that, of your career. I was saying, mate, when this fight got announced, a few people were like, ooh, you know, it could be a bit soon, you know what I mean? Um, and I was saying, nah, I feel like I'm at that level. And I want to prove it, you know, I think you have tonight. Yeah, right. the thing is, like, you can't go on fighting, with all due respect, journeyman, yeah, for the remainder of your career. Like, I've got the greatest of respect for them, and I know you have, but the thing is, how are you going to progress your career yeah, if you're fighting the same yeah, guys? There's too many people happy doing that, you know what I mean? I'm not one of them, I wouldn't. That was, that was a step up, you know what I mean? But no matter what, what about the result, it was a step up. Yeah. Um, and I want another step up next one, someone with a winning record, you, just, you know what I mean? I, I feel like I'm ready for these fights, I might have said it to people, you know, because of my age, yeah. a lot of them feel like, oh, you know, at first, when, when we first turned over, you know, me and Blaine, we were happy to kind of pull the reins a bit, and because of my age, take me time. Um, in the last few months, I've just, I can feel myself getting better, and I feel like I'm ready for these fights, I don't want to hang about boxing gym, you know what I mean? I want to be in fights where, I mean, like people said tonight, oh, you know, it could be a bit of a run match that. Yeah. yeah, I want people to say, too soon for him, like, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. And then I'll show up with him. Well, that's the thing though, like I was saying about you going in with journeyman, like you've learned, you know, you've had fights yeah. and you've done the learning fights. Yeah, and a lot of people said, you know, you, you need that experience and you need, I nearly 100 amateur fights, you know what I mean? I've been boxing since I was eight. It's not much more experience. <laughs> yeah, you've got to learn, learn the pro game. It is different, but, um, I feel like I'm adapting well. You certainly are, mate. Yeah, you, know you just, I mean, you just, yeah. just stopped Alistair Warren and you look yeah. at his record, you look at the guys he's been in with as well. Yeah. And I, I allude back to that win that he's just had last year. You know, you just stop the guy. Yeah. You just stop the guy really, yeah. and, really and quickly. And even, like, even when he loses, mate, he gives people tests and he exactly. takes hands off him and that. Um, John Telford. Yeah. You know, he had, no, he had a draw with John Telford yeah. and John Telford's now fighting for the central area. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? I'd be, I'd be daft if I wasn't watching that fight and thinking, I'm not far off that. Yeah. You know what I mean? I, I know, I know. I've not done the rounds yet. I'm not even completing six rounds. You know what I mean? I've had two six rounds and not not gone the distance. But if I'm watching that fight later and I'm not thinking a few fights down the line, that that could be me. Yeah, but yeah. look at what's going on in boxing at the moment. Like, look at Danny Dubai, who's just won the yeah. British heavyweight title in 12 yeah. fights. So, you know, people were saying, oh, is this too soon for him? And the same, yeah. obviously, we are stable, mate. Yeah. Nathan, you know, people are saying the same thing. Oh, they're taking fights at this stage of the career. And credit to them. And it's the same with you, credit to you. You know what I mean, though, mate? Like, just took a fight and, you know what I mean? Nathan is lost. So what? You know what I mean? I, I, I've said that both of them you know, are going to do big things in boxing. Whoever wins that fight is just going to be fast tracked. Yeah. I still think Nathan's going to do big, big things. No, I believe. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. It's under but, um, agree. He's, I'd like say, mate, records are for DJs. That's aren't they? it, records, records are for DJs. DJs mate. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not scared of losing that all, you know what I mean? And um, Which a lot of people are. Um, I don't plan on doing it anytime soon, but I'm not scared of going in them 50 50 fights. I actually love being in them fights, mate, when people are saying, oh, I don't think he's going to win that, you know, I think it's a bit soon for him. I think that's when you'll see how, you know, how good I am. Yeah, but that's where you've stepped up the levels, like you've done yeah. with Alistair Warren. You stepped yeah, up a yeah. level there, people saying, oh, I don't know, it's a tough match, you know. But then you just went and stopped him emphatically, yeah, yeah. and that's that a big statement for you. So, yeah. like you just said earlier, is that the plan for you now? Are you want to go on and take the next step and I'm gonna get a, maybe someone with more Definitely. of a 50-50 record? I want, mate, I want someone with a winning record next. Yeah, and then, um, a lot of people want to say it. A lot of people are like, yeah, yeah, it takes time and that, but no, there's only so many gym when you get up for or, Fights. And I think I've shown a level of that and you know what I mean, there's anyone out there with a winning record. The problem is half the time, a lot of these kids with winning records aren't willing to box other kids with winning yeah. records. You know what I mean? Well I am so 
that's happy, you know what I mean? Let's have it. Whatever, whatever comes, but yeah, mate, I'm, um, I'm happy, I'm looking forward to it. I've got two dates before the end of the year. Um, the plan is another two six rounders. That could change, like, you know what I mean? But um, another two six rounders, everything goes to plan, I'll leave it 8 and 0 by the end of the year. Then next year, we'll be behind up these big fights. So you've got a Central Area title fight that we're going to yeah. be watching tonight. And it's going to be a I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> there are two top lads and I know them well. You know, I've known John, John's from our Maya area, you know, I've known him for years. I do a lot of Anthony Jack. Um, it's going to be a dust up, like me. It's going to be a dust up. But like I said before, mate, if I'm not looking at that thinking, somewhere down the line, you know, this could be me, I, I think I'm, I'm doing it wrong. You know what yeah, I mean? Just, so, I, I, I've got to be thinking about that. But, um, yeah, now we're really looking forward to that. Do you top lads, going to be a dust up. So what about the support then for this particular fight, the support, the sponsorships, give them all the shout out? Yeah, yeah, um, obviously everyone who buys tickets, it's, a lot of people don't know how it works, how it works do they, nope. um, selling these small little shows and that, so it's such a win, everyone buys the ticket, you, think, you know what I mean, you put the money in my pocket, and it's like, as soon no, as they you don't, they don't understand, yeah, they don't as soon understand. as they hear the word professional, they think big money, um, and it's not the way, but, you know what I mean, I, I'm happy doing what I'm doing, and, living the life mate, I'm um, doing what I love full time, you know, I can't complain but yeah my sponsors mate, we've got CBD Believe, uh, ISS Limited, Pain Solutions in Lynn and um, I've got John Howard for you, so it's me, me mate I'll be butcher, um, you know what I mean, I couldn't, couldn't do it without them so massively, massively uh, grateful for that, letting me do what I love mate. That's it, week doing it full out. time, yeah, yeah doing it full complain. time. Can't no. complain. Well I've got to let you go. Great performance, great seeing you in the ring, great emphatic win. Looking forward to seeing your next one. Looking forward to it, Brad. Thanks awesome. for speaking nice to one, us. Mate. Cheers, mate.